Verify the glide path agrees with the approach chart within one degree. Did a malfunction in the flight computer used to program the autopilot lead to the crash of UPS Flight 1354? Verify approach, point one degrees. The flight management system to an airline pilot in an airline operation like this is very critical because it is the automation. It is the typical way of flying a large aircraft. If you have bad data in, that data will cause bad things to happen. Okay. Let's hook this up. Investigators recover the flight computer's memory card from the wreckage. They prepare to test it for signs of errors or malfunctions. The investigators went to great pains to figure out what exactly was loaded into the flight management computer. It was damaged, so they had to remove the motherboard and place it in a functioning unit and, and actually read it out. They should tell us if the computer was working. If the flight computer was operational, investigators should be able to download its memory. It's working. It turned out that there was nothing wrong with the flight management computer. But had there been, that could have been a very important part of the accident sequence. The computer was working. Looks like they programmed it. Final approach is armed for a gradual descent of three degrees. Wait a minute. They've got two separate destinations programmed. They forgot to clear the conflict. They discovered the crew missed a step in planning their route to Birmingham Airport. They failed to clear a previously programmed destination. It's a troubling find. You can load a flight plan into it, and then if you deviate from that particular flight plan, the flight management computer doesn't really know what's going on and can put out false data, and that's called a discontinuity. The crew programmed the plane to fly directly to Birmingham Airport. 20 miles out, they needed to clear their flight path and program a specific approach to runway 18. But the crew didn't clear the initial plan which created the discontinuity, a confusion in the system. So there was a conflict between where the pilots told the airplane to start the approach and where the computer knew the approach had to start. And that was a flight plan discontinuity. That's why the autopilot wouldn't initiate the descent path. The captain basically was chasing the incorrect guidance that the display was telling him by trying to descend as quickly as he could when there was no reason for it. The team knows the crew didn't clear the conflict. The question is why. <laughs> 